October on Twitter, I'll be reviewing this brand new, this short movie dropped on Netflix. It's called The After. And this movie, it is starring David O. Leo. Uh, I might be saying his name wrong. Uh, I actually really personally like this actor. I think he's a really good actor. And if you've known uh, David, he's really, he's been doing many uh, like Oscar nominated movie or like Oscar like a nomination worthy movie so you know i was really excited to see this short and i, I think this short actually got many uh praise uh, when this uh, short initially debuted in a film festival uh that is what i was reading about this movie and i found out and this is only like 20 something minutes long and uh, often the shorts are on netflix they are interesting and uh, this one i was definitely was very exciting to see this because of the actor <laughs> he's a really good actor and he was really good in this short so this short centers around his character he has this daughter and wife and in tragic accident in the short we see that they basically get stabbed by the stranger out of nowhere then the daughter died then the mom jump off from the bridge and then after this uh, incident uh, david's character he's trying to move on with his life and we see in this movie he drives around uh, people in his uber like he's basically an uber driver in this movie so a lot of his time he you know he listened to people's problem people some on his uber there like this movie trying to showcase i think uh, how uber driver uh, driving people around and then uh, one day he met this uh, passenger like this guy and his wife and the daughter It's kind of like his daughter age and we see in this uh, short the end of the ride this daughter uh, basically hugs him and after that he just cries and this movie like he, he, he also cries and he then he goes back to his uh, like car and this movie ends and I was like thinking is this uh, like a her hug implied then he healed from his trauma because like uh, that's how this movie ends and I was there thinking huh that was like <laughs> kind of weird uh, so this movie David Olai uh, oh, he, I cannot say his name I'm so sorry and uh, looks like his character he, he doesn't have any dialogue honestly this movie tried to imply that you know he's under so much trauma and you know he's trying to heal from all these people's conversation or like he's listening to them and uh, i guess this passenger made him uh okay end of this uh, movie which is to me i felt like it was kind of like whoa what that is sort of my reaction when this movie ends i was like really uh that's how you held uh i think maybe it was like uh like he i wouldn't say he was fully healed maybe it was just beginning of his journey to be healed that is what i thought end of this did I like this short? What I liked in this short? Because you have seen this kind of story before. Uh, I personally still, I liked David, his uh, performance. He was really good. He doesn't disappoint, does he? He's a really good actor. He was really good in this. I like his performance in this. Overall, this short, uh, I don't know I, if I like it, like meant anything that much. Although it is name is the after, the aftermath of this trauma. Uh, I will say it is okay. Like, I didn't thought it was great, but I certainly didn't thought it was waste of time or anything. Enjoy this actor performance. Overall, I was like, okay, <laughs> that is what I was thinking. Uh, but it could have been better if the ending was like something, or if he said something. Then again, you know, this kind of trauma. What can you say? <laughs> Yeah, that is what I was thinking. And that was my thought on this. Let me know in the comment. What do you think about this short? If you enjoyed this review, don't your mother review on other Netflix movie and show. If you enjoyed this, please subscribe. Until I see you next time, please take care.